Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Shelvia, and in today's episode, I'm going to create this beautiful planter. This is one of my favorite DIYs till today. Although I've not done many of the DIYs, I think I've done a uh, five, six DIYs maybe. But yes, this is by far one of my favorites. Let's get started. Today I'm going to create a planter using the trash can from the Dollar Tree. And I have these carpet brushes from Dollar Tree again. I'm going to remove these bristles from the brush and then attach them at the end of this to give it a planter look. So now I've removed all the bristles from these brushes and I have smoothened the surface using a sandpaper. I'm going to use this uh, wood filler to fill all these gaps and leave it for about uh, 20 to 20 to 30 minutes and after that it will be ready to be painted. Okay, let's start. So now the brushes are ready with the putty filled in and they have completely dried out. I'm going to spray paint them with this black paint and primer. The sticks are now dried out. I'm going to um, stick them together around the this trash can and I'll be using these cable ties to hold them together. Also, I plan to use this E6000 so that they stay in place. So I'm marking the place where I want these sticks to be holding this can. This is fine. And now, what I first do is use a cable tie. Okay, so this is ready and now I'm going to cut the remaining cable ties. Okay, I don't think I will use this E6000 glue anymore. 
uh, the cable ties have made these this trash can pretty sturdy. So I'm using this jute cord so that this becomes the stand becomes more sturdy. Oh, come on. So I'm going to use um, this old plant can that I had initially and I've used the same 2 no it's not 2 millimeter. I think it is 4 maybe 5 I think it is 4 millimeter or maybe 5 millimeter jute cord and then I've used it to wrap around this plant box and then I will be keeping it inside this planter and I will be keeping another plant box inside it. Are you ready?